Okay, so on this, <clears throat> on this video, I'd like to talk about the addiction to thinking and using the observer. So just as when there is um, observing a table or a TV, um, there is an intuitive or knowingness that the table is an object and it's not anything to do with what you are. So the next thing then to recognize is in letting go of the, <clears throat> the addiction to being in the, in the thinking is that, is there, um, is there something, because thoughts are just passing by uh, or arise and, and pass away, but is there a deeper awareness or observing of the thoughts? And then what's experienced is uh, there is a distance. There's a, a watchingness or a distance, and there's a, there's a, there's a deeper intimacy of an experience which is not the thoughts and then the thoughts see you know with this distance then um you can also use uh, cancelling beliefs uh, before doing this like cancel my belief that my thoughts are meaningful or that i need to think for survival i'm an infinite being that will also help uh, delete some of the core belief systems around needing to think or thinking that the thinking is actually useful. So um, when I was talking to someone, you know, it could be seen suddenly like uh, the, the, the thoughts are like watching a TV set, a bad addiction, and one can just uh, not be interested. Like in a movie, one can either be glued to the movie screen or not. So the thoughts pass by. For myself, it was like, uh, um, it was like a location of thoughts, you know, it's like an entertainment. You can be inter entertained by the thinking that's going on or refuse it. And then um, uh, it's more meaningless. And then there's a deeper awareness of something more intimate that is not the thinking or needs to go or get identified or hooked in with the thoughts. And then, the, uh, and then eventually there's experiences of no thought or uh, Hawkins would call that no mind. So it's just uh, an infinite holy presence, uh, which is most, most exquisite uh, when it happens. Uh, and, and it's just an immediacy of life. And there's no, the, the thinker is gone. <clears throat> the thing that wants to say it's beautiful or uh, the silence here that dissolves in a holy presence. So I just wanted to share that on letting go of the addiction to the thinking mind.